Well, nearly six months into the job, Broome County Sheriff Fred Akshar has focused much of his efforts on addressing issues inside the county jail. Through an aggressive recruitment effort, he added 29 new corrections officers to combat chronic understaffing. And he's receiving input from the community regarding conditions within the facility and preparing the inmates for when they get out. The jail advisory group consists of local health, workforce, and social service professionals, as well as advocates and previously incarcerated individuals. It started meeting last December before Akshar took office. If we're not standing up a very uh, robust reentry program, then we're failing not only the people who are incarcerated, but we're in essence failing the community because undoubtedly they will go back out and reoffend. Penny Stringfield supported Akshar's campaign and agreed to chair the group. While there are larger structural issues to address, Stringfield says the sheriff got right to work putting some of the recommendations and requests into effect. I don't think I ever expected that we would have accomplished as much as we have already in five months. That includes providing those inmates leaving the jail with a sheriff's ID if they need, and providing better access to feminine hygiene products and clean underwear to the female inmates. The sheriff's office has also restored 30 active programs with classes available every week. Sharon Chesna is the executive director of the Mothers and Babies Perinatal Network, which offers parenting classes, sex education, and assistance to pregnant mothers in the community. She was eager to provide a bridge between programs within the jail and those on the outside. We'd like to get back into the jail. We'd love to do whatever we can to help out because we know that it's super important that everybody who's incarcerated, for whatever the reason is, that they have access to community services once they get out to make sure that they have the services they need and hopefully don't have to end up coming back to jail. Akshar has also reformed the grievance process and expanded visitation. A larger ongoing issue is how to provide the proper mental health and addiction treatment that so many of the inmates need. As a human being and a community member, my feeling about jail is that if this is what you want, this should be an opportunity for rehabilitation, not just punishment. Akshar says it's important to hold criminals accountable, but also give them the tools to succeed once they leave. He plans to continue building partnerships with outside organizations. Set goals and objectives. Um, I just don't want to meet for the sake of meeting. Um, but so long as we're seeing progress, we're, we're going to continue to do what we're doing. Akshar says reducing recidivism is a win-win for everyone. Akshar says he also plans to launch a Broome County Sheriff's app that will provide the public with safety updates and allow the families to communicate with inmates, send commissary or photos, and pay bail using their phone.